What is up, boys? I should probably turn down that music. Okay, that should be better. Hello, everybody. Sorry that it took me a few minutes to get started. I had to make a TikTok about the fact that I'm doing this stream. The reason for that is because today's stream is inspired by, as it says in the title, Nick is not green in Gus Johnson's most recent video, uh, in which they rate Pokemon. It's extremely good. I'm actually going to drop the link in the chat because it is a funny fucking video. I really enjoyed it. Um, but they actually made the link to that tier list available to the masses. Um, so I'm actually using the exact same Pokemon they did. I'm going to drop the link for the video. There we go, boys. Um, I'm using the same Pokemon they did, but I altered their tier list a little bit. I say a little bit. I altered it a fair bit. Um, I'm actually gonna copy the link that I sent in the chat um, because I want to show you. <sighs> oh, that worked. Okay, boys. I want to show you something. Gotta mute the Nintendo just for a sec. Okay. Yeah, okay I'm down for that. I need to show you what their tier list looks like because it is extremely good, extremely powerful. Um, I just want to show you their tiers. Um, I have been re-watching this bad boy all day. Okay. Oh, god damn it. Where's their tier list? Um, Nick and Gus's ultimate Pokemon tier list is what we're working with today. Um, okay. Let me just mute their video, but turn my fun music back on, because that's what I actually want here. I'm a little bit, woo, if you can't tell, so I'm having a really good time. Um, let me see. There we go. Okay, back up a little. Um, first tier that they have is, uh, why can't you see what I'm looking at? Hey, so remember how I said I'm a little bit like, um, it's because, yeah. I trust you were not looking at the same thing. I was like, say hi to yourselves. Say hi, chat. Hi, chat. <laughs> I didn't even test this beforehand. Why? <laughs> Easy fix. There we go. Hi, chat. <laughs> okay. A little better. So the first tier on their video, judging Pokemon with Gus Johnson, uh, is believes OJ looks innocent. 50s housewife. Uh, shut up. Sorry, that was mean. I like Gus a lot. That was mean. Uh, arrested for tax fraud. Could win a small town election. Kill God. Um, I think I missed a couple, but some of the ones I actually kept. Um, Dicky the House, like, Great Kisser. I kept that one. Um, I did some changes, but okay. So here is how my tier list is going to work. Here's how mine is going to work, besties. Tier 1, listens to the Joe Rogan podcast. These are not in order of how good they are because a lot of them are bad. Like, these are not tier lists from, like, best to worst. Like, these are ranked based on vibes you know so it's not like a, a good to bad kind of thing it's just categorizing them together first one listens to the joe rogan podcast second one housewife or male wife three great kisser four arrested for indecent exposure five tasty if cooked six right smut fic about obama that was a joint that was that was a joint effort between me and shiloh i was asking them for help um and they wanted me to do one with Obama because they have, they have a tick, uh, they, they have autism, and so they they have ticks, and one of them is Obama, just like in that video of former president. I don't want to say his name. I don't want to summon them, you know. Um. Anyway, next one could win a small town election, and the final one, gay, 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 gay. So. Boys, please do not forget to give me hydrate zones tonight because good fucking God. I'll be dehydrated. I forgot about the sub goal. Okay, listen, boys, I should be I should be honest. I've been feeling guilty about that sub goal. And the reason is because I have not been urging anybody to give to that sub goal because I did not want to play a FNAF stream. I didn't. I really didn't. Um, but Halloween's coming up. I'm feeling a little braver. <sighs> I am feeling a little braver. So Thursday is going to be the last day. Okay. So we have today's stream and Thursday's stream to, to get the subs up. What I'm going to do is I am going to lower the sub goal because I do want to play it 
and I did set that unreasonably high. That was a little mean, I will admit it. Um, where did I put the... Ba, 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 ba. Where did I put it? Where's my sub goal, boys? Where did I put it? Did you guys eat my fucking... Did you guys eat my goddamn stream counter? There it is. I'm so good at this. Okay. Oh, and Minky, just in time, uh, just redeemed. Please, sir. Any spare subs? Any spare subs for Paul Often Boy? Any at all? Please, sir. <laughs> please, let a little boy play FNAF in his lifetime. Please, God, please. <laughs> Which is bold coming from me. I don't know what the. Oh! I need the goal. Oops. Okay. So, what do we have so far? The starting amount was like 19. I'm gonna lower it to like. Um, I'm gonna lower it to like 35. Let's do 40. And I'm like, that's still pretty egregious. Um, thank you for the sip sips, Tivo. Tonight I'm drinking Kratom and raspberry lemonade. Okay. Uh, title. Um. St uh, stinky. Stinky Scared Boy plays FNAF. Oh, that's close enough. Okay. And after... No, not... not Okay, 09, 30, 2021. 20, okay, that should be good. Stinky Scared Boy plays FNAF. No! No! How many was that? How many? Fuck! Fuck! Thank you, Becky. <laughs> I love you. Thank you. What the fuck? Okay, well now. Fuck. <laughs> so the sub goal didn't count it because you donated right before I started the new sub goal. So to be fair, I will update it. But just know that I am not happy about it. Oh my god. St oh no, this is untenable. Okay, stinky scared boy, please. <laughs> but now, God, I should have just left it. I should have just not let y'all notice it. So that was 19 plus 10, that's 29. Oh, fuck no, I'm upping that. Fuck no. No. Um, I'll up it to like 40? 45? How much is that? 10, 15? Okay. Okay, so for about 30, I'll do like 45. And after the ninth on... No, 2021. I know how dates work, boys. Okay. Fuck you! Fuck you, Becky! That was so close! Ah! Okay. Okay. All right, you're gonna have to go, boys. We are still- Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Listen. Once we got- We got a little too close to our comfort. <laughs> I'm far too- It's far too close to comfort. Oh, fuck. I swear to God, I just saw my life flash before my fucking eye- did I not title it? Did I not title it? I literally did. Okay. I'm gonna shit myself. Please. Can I? Okay. Starting amount, 29. I almost did over a thousand. That was not what I meant to do. 30. 30. Okay. Okay. There we go. There we go. Why is it not going? You know, boys, I might just shit myself. I fucking hate stream labs. Stinky scared. Boy. I like how... <laughs> I like how the sub alerts are just still coming in. Okay. Oh. That's it. I did the thing I always do. Which is... I, um... 2021 there we go i always hit done but i don't hit start goal rip shy just for dean please sir please sir. any spare any spare subs any at all i just read what becky said that's so mean but you are so right okay okay fine um you know i started <laughs> When, whenever me and Shiloh were watching through markiplier's uh fnaf playlist i accidentally certainly I accidentally searched Markiplier Fanat on 
YouTube, and I thought it was funny, so I've been t I've been calling it that ever since. Okay, boys. Oh God. Oh no. King or sub so that up. Uh, Becky, I swear to fucking God. I swear to- Okay, well now there's a fucking hype train. Now there's a goddamn fucking hype train. Okay, so I guess if we hit this goal, October, I'm gonna be playing FNAF. Fuck! Fuck! I should've just let y'all not notice. Like, I should- I should've just kept it real quiet. Real quiet, real safe. You already got it up to the next- Oh my god. This is a nightmare. This is a fucking nightmare. Okay, so we're at what, 31 right now? Okay, we're at 31 at the moment, but Becky said to add one more because I did, I did miss King Or's, okay. I did miss King Or's, don't know. So it's like what, 32? Goal amount, oh no. If I have to remake this goal one more time, then I'm gonna shit myself. Those alerts just keep fucking coming in, huh? You know, one day I will learn how to lower the volume of my um, alerts, but not today. Okay, boy. I just said, okay, boy. Like, you're my sons. Stinky scare boy plays Fnat. Okay, we should be good. We should be. <sighs> Yuri's redeemed yet another. Please, sir. Uh, any spare subs? Any, any spare subs? <laughs> Please don't. <laughs> Did Biblio subscribe before I could... Oh my god, stop. I'm still not sure if I should up it again. Okay, okay, you know what? I'm gonna focus on me. I'm gonna focus on my Pokemons. Minky just redeemed. Please. <laughs> please, uh, please. I know, Becky. Were you not fucking listening? I said why I said that. God, level 5 high train. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh my god. I hate this. This stream started, like, not even, like... 10 minutes ago, five, like, no, about 20 minutes ago, and you're already making me hit the sub goal. I knew, I should have kept it at 66, and no one would have fucking noticed. I shouldn't have lowered it. I should, I shouldn't have even lowered it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. So, first of all, the Pokemon list, because this is what I wanted to do with you all. I gifted two best ideas from a dance. <laughs> Literally every single time I've done- oh my god. <laughs> Fine, Becky, I apologize. I don't mean to be mean to you. Sticky scared boy plays the net. Um, starting amount 34. I'm not changing it again after this. Okay. There we go, boys. Thank you for the hydrate zone. <laughs> and thank you for the sip sip. All right, boys. Okay, first about our list. Is Weepin' Bell Baby. So let's take a look at this boy. Just a massive fucking schnoz. Let me, let me look, let me look. Fanat is in your near future, my dear stinky boy. Piece of shit. Piece of shit. This is the boy. Now this, to me... What is this giving? Okay, I can see this being gay. At the same time, um... The original video rated them as a great kisser, but here's the thing. Even though they have the lips for it, I don't think I want to kiss that. I don't know. They definitely have the mouth for it. But I feel... Excuse me. I feel like that could be... I, f I feel like this could be a, ha a male wife. No, Kingor, this is not a monster fucker stream. We are, we are solely rating Pokemon on a, a tier list. Um, arrested. Tasty if cooked. Now, tasty if cooked, I had to consider, but those eyes are a little bit too sentient for my liking, so I don't know that I would actually feel good cooking them. I could see the whites of their eyes, and that doesn't feel right. Gay plant. It looks like a fish to me. It does look like a fish. Um... Weeping Bell is gay, but also Kiss is good. God damn. 
the fact that y'all like immediately bumped us up to like level five of the hype train. It's like 38 seconds left on that one on level five. Spoon them out, make a salad. Salty, salty. Okay, you all are being very aggressive about about arresting this man. No, he would not be arrested for indecent exposure. Um, absolutely not. Hey, hey, hey guys, hey guys. Thank you guys so much for the hype train. What the fuck? I appreciate you so much. Oh my god. Uh, scared the shit out of me. We are... I was deprived. Twitch put me at 68%. Are gay rights not real? Are gay, are gay rights not real? What am I supposed to, What am I supposed to do? <sighs> okay. Okay. Um, I'm not going to arrest him for indecent exposure. I don't think he... Well, maybe he does write smut about Obama. <sighs> I'm putting this in the male life category. I think that he would make a mean salad. Not him personally, but I think he could cook one up. You know what I'm saying? God, this jazz. This goes so extremely hard. Okay. Weeping Bell, I'm going to put in the male wife category. I feel right about that. That feels, that feels just right. It was just right. So next up is coughing. Um, who the fuck is that? Coughing? Oh, I think he's like an ugly one. Oh, that is one ugly motherfucker. Okay. Okay. Um. I think he listens to the Joe Rogan podcast. Like, right off the bat, that's what he's giving. Um, although I feel like he could also be arrested for indecent exposure. Um. What are we thinking? Arrested or Joe Rogan? Oh, no. The name is... The name is Coffin. It it would make sense, actually, if he was the Joe Rogan podcast. <laughs> Y'all really want him to get arrested. Just because I'm see I'm not really seeing how genitals would work here, and he looks like he is tooting, he's gonna go on the Joe Rogan podcast. Exceedingly exciting. Okay. Boys, we are doing so good. Next up is Zatu. Who is that? Let me see. I think that's like a bird one. Ba, 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 da. Okay, cute little bird. Um, this is adorable. This is adorable. Um, I can see this is gay. I can see this is pretty gay. Bird apron. True. This could be a housewife. Um, however, is she tasty if cooked? Is she tasty? Although I can also see her as writing some outfit about Obama. If she's okay, if she's a housewife, then she is also writing some outfit about Obama. That's all brain boy. <laughs> okay, I I'm not even checking to see like what types they are. Okay, well Aries says not to eat the lesbian wife. Okay, well the tiny eyes of their chest is their child. <laughs> I had not even noticed those. Oh my god. Okay. It seems like you all really want this to be a wife. Look at the cute little shoes and everything. She's precious. No, I really can't complain. I can I can see her as a housewife. Um, we'll definitely drop hints about the typing, especially for psychic bird. Um, that is a good idea because that honestly, with the psychics, I don't know about anything else, but I think knowing if it's a psychic would change where I put them. That would change my opinion of them. She even wears a ponytail. You're right. Next up is Shuckle, which is this cute little turtle boy. He is so cute. Ba, 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 da, ba, ba, da. Oh, <laughs> he looks like a little turtle. He's got Shuckle is just rock type. He's a loser. So cruel. Oh, brainless. Not a thought behind those eyes. I don't know, Becky. I was thinking about that, but I feel like getting into that shell would be pretty complicated. Although, at the same time, it could be like a coconut. Once you break it up open, there's a lot of really good meat inside. I'm not sure. Maybe this is like an escargot situation. That I can see. 
Listen, this isn't Monsterfuckers Biblio. I'm not doing a snuggle tier. I, let me see. I feel like this could be kind of tasty. Cultural delicacy like an Oscar. Like Oscar, like an oyster. See, Cookie, I would say male wife, but look at him. I don't think he could pick up a spoon. Um, I can see him being eaten like an oyster. You're right. A delicacy squid oyster. No, I can see that. I absolutely can. I don't think he really has the brain power for much else. So sad. May he rest in peace. Next up is Mill Tank. This one is just a fucking cow, I think. It's just like someone's weird cowgirl fantasy. Mill Tank. Yeah. Literally got udders. Um She's cute. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna lie. The t the tibbies are out though. Um I think Listen, the problem is that Miltank has beef. But those eyes are so fucking human. At the same time. Titties out. So <laughs> I feel like She's either a, a housewife or arrested for a decent exposure or gay, especially the last two. I could see her being gay or arrested for indecent exposure. Here's the thing. I think we should destigmatize de titties. Why should we get mad at her for having her titties out? But not, but not bulls, not male cows. Your sexism is, your se oh my God. Your sexism is, your, your, your sexism is starting to show. So. <laughs> um, I think she's gay. I think she's gay. She's a pastel emo gay cow. <laughs> yeah, no. She's gay if I've ever seen a gay. Next up is Licky Licky. Um... The, the kissing category, the great kisser category that Gus and Nick had is one that I don't know if I can carry out, um, if I can carry it out well, but uh, I can't go changing the tears. I might just change it. I might just change it. Um, or I might keep it rather. Yeah. Licky Licky looks like pudding. Moose Man is making fun of me. Your sexism. Um, how is that indecent? Looky, looky, great kisser are soft. French kiss, he's homophobic. Y'all, okay. Um, I can see him being a very closeted gay. Um, but he does also look like pudding. So I feel like I ought to, I ought to cook him up. Like maybe I, sh maybe I should cook him up with a little sugar and cinnamon. You know, he is shiny. And I think that's part of why he looks like pudding to me. I don't want to see your tongue at all times. <laughs> Arrest, jail for life. Would you cook pudding? Actual pudding is made on the stove top. So yeah, actually. He's a twink in the deepest denial. Aries, stop chanting indecency. Where is his indecency? Oh my God. Uh, although if we're going based on vibes, no, that's still a gay. Look at them. I feel like they're each other's beards. Showing your tongue is indecency now? Good God. You know if Twitch was to implement that, we all would have been gone a long time ago. Next up is Tan Growth. I don't remember who that is. Tan gro Growth. Oh, I don't trust him. He's gonna whip his dick out. He's gonna whip his dick out. I don't trust him. I don't trust him. Not even a little. No, he is, he is 100% getting arrested for flashing. He already has the coat. He has a built-in coat. You're done. You're done. No, Tangrowth obscene. Obscene motherfucker. Our first, our first arrest for indecent exposure, boys. Next up is Pat Rat, who they called Matt Pat in the video. Um, I think this was just like an angry chipmunk. 
This music. Mwah. Very angry squirrel. I want to cook that motherfucker up. I want to cook that motherfucker up. Whole criminal, I can see. I can see him robbing a bank. I can't see him pulling out his dick. You know what I mean? Pat is a bootlicker. Pat can run for office, does small crime. I can see him as a as a, a slimy mayor who who like fools who like fools all the townspeople and gets in there. I can't see him whipping his dick out. I ah, I feel like he tastes good though. <laughs> Pat Rat says that protesters must be more like more well behaved. God damn. The mayor of Stardew Valley. Well, um, I am gonna put him on small town election. I think he's a very fast talker. I think he's a smooth talker, but every so often that crazy temper gets the best of him. And then you're in for trouble. This next one is literally fucking called Among Us. It's lit it's fuck it's called fucking Among Us. Like everyone congratulate Scott. He was the first one to get it in the chat. Fucking Among Us? Fucking He looks like He looks like he's just made out of a Pokeball and I don't like that. Okay, Aries says cry Hey Aries, you said most of them are crimes lately. Um, that looks like a mushroom to me, though. I feel like he could be cooked right up. He, he does look shifty. But I think I could eat him. Like, I'm pretty sure- Makes a delicious stir-fry king, or you are exactly right. You are exactly right. Uh, yeah. Fried mushroom stir-fry. Look at those lips. Um, I don't want to kiss him is the difference. For the reason Zeno listed right after. Um, I'm gonna eat this motherfucker. So far, we're picking weird foods. Really weird foods. I digress, though. Next up is Tynamo. Who is that? Tynamo. They called him a little cum boy in the video, which I don't feel right about. Um, he's extremely cute, but you can't tell him that you cannot pop that bad boy in your mouth. Put him in your stir fry. Becky said it. Eat. Eat. Tynamo is not going to pull his dick out. Shut up. I am going to eat him, though. Like, what are you do What are you doing? You know what I mean? Snack the smiles back. The fish that goes up. He's a baby, but you could eat him. As if baby fish aren't considered a delicacy in certain areas. Shut up. I can't see much else for him if not being eaten. I Eden? <laughs> God. Um, oh, but a male wife. He's either doomed to a life of male wifery, or we are eating him. I think he's too young to get married. Fuck. Thank you, Kigor, for the subs. Yeah. So I, I, I think he's probably far too young to get married. Um, but I, I am. I'm gonna eat him. Could not cook no arms. You're right. That is why I'm gonna cook him. Perfect. Delicious. Next up, boys. Electric. This one is ugly, if I remember correctly. Pokemon. Electric. There we go. God damn, this guy is ugly. He's so fucking ugly. God, he's the worst. He's the worst. Aries, I'm sorry I ate him. Um, I think he could also be edible. However, would he get arrested for indecent exposure? Ooh, the Joe Rogan. Th ah. I was going to say, I think he's more well-intentioned than that, but I don't know if he is. Oh, God, look at those teeth. God, he chomped your dick right off. I don't like the way his mouth looks. He's slimy Joe Rogan. <sighs> I don't want to eat him. He just looks poisonous. I don't trust him even a little bit. Um, I think he's pulling his dick out. He looks untrustworthy. Mr. Baby is, I think, the previous evolution. 
Wow, he is really going from like the best to the fucking worst. Um, I think he's gonna pull his dick out. I could hear him screaming out men being marginalized. God damn. I feel like he'd fit right in next to either of these two fellas. You know what I'm saying? This is hard. Oh, Tynamo, Electric, Electros. Okay, okay, okay. Um, I'm leaving him at indecent exposure. But just know that I don't trust him even a little bit. Not even a little bit. Next up is Guzzlord. Which sounds like a like an adult film star name but Guzzlord that's a bad name that's a bad oh no what oh he can see out the back of him okay so that's him with his mouth closed and that's open and it just goes straight you could shoot into that motherfucker and the arrow would go pew it would go right through him right through him Guzzlord is a 14 username. Oh, Shy says politician. Everyone else is saying Joe Rogan. I could see him as being a uh, like a corporate CEO running for, for small town mayor. <laughs> In one hole out the other. Best for four. Okay, okay. Um I think he probably is gonna listen to the Joe Rogan podcast. Um I don't trust him. I don't trust him at all. He's got a big-ass mouth. Not mutually exclusive. Um, you could shoot in that motherfucker. I did not think you meant arrows. <laughs> I don't know. Somehow arrows was the first thing I thought of. He's got two heads. He's got his little eyes right here, and then he got the little eyes up there. That's so cute. Yeah. Yeah, sorry. He's the boss dude from Monsters, Inc. God, that's fucking funny. That is so good. Also, to be fair, I said small town election, not... Mayor. So that could be treasurer, secretary, board member, chairman of the board even. But he will not be holding uh, any such positions in office. Next up is Melton. God, the suggestions on that are awful. Which looks like a fucking hex nut. What is that for? Not edible. Not, not edible. Melton is just a big eye. Listen, the body is cute, but that head is so goddamn silly. It's a baby. It's a little guy. It's just a little baby. So where are we putting him? I can't eat him in good conscience. Um, a lot of these are pretty mature themes. I feel like it's a gay motherfucker. Actually, if this is a teenager, I feel like they write smut fic. Hey, this guy's writing smut fic about Obama. He's definitely right. He's got the big ass eyes for like staring at Wattpad. He's writing. I feel like he's writing a smug fic. I could see him being gay though. Gay is also good. I'm envisioning like a teenager. His eyes to stare at men. He's gay. He's gay in the same way Meowth is gay. Which one is Meowth? Is that who I'm thinking of? Melton is gay in the same way Meowth is gay. This was not the one I was thinking of. <sighs> yeah, I don't know. You're, I don't. I, I'm not sure. I follow you. Oh, also, also, I should clarify. Hey, boys. Hey, guys. Hey. I think you all might have forgotten. I don't know anything about Pokemon. I was not raised watching this show nor playing the games. I'm a complete noob, and I'm very unqualified to actually be giving any opinions on the Pokemon. Um, but that is what made me really that was what made me like really want to do this because i was like i have no right to be doing this look at the hand movements that is the swagger of a gay person god that's funny um oh yeah no i don't know jack shit about him um so next up um oh i can't even say next up i didn't decide where hex nut goes fuck his name is melton um the glaring mouth is gay regular mouth stuff. Is that who I'm thinking of? I think of Big Meowth.
No, that's not who I was thinking of. I was thinking of the big sexy one. The big sexy one. The silver one with the big ass hips. Looks kind of like a cat. Thank you for the sip sip. It's the really iconic one. Everyone got really horny for it in Monster Fuckers. Allo. Mewtwo! Mewtwo! Yes! Yes, that's who it is. Big ass hips. You love to see it. Glam cat with the curly tail. You're right, Mewtwo. Mewtwo. Yeah, that's why. They both have like mews or meows in them. That's why. Okay, focusing on Melton. Um, is this bitch writing on Wattpad about Obama? Or... What was the other one? Or is he gay? God, I feel like it's both. And I feel like it's implied that if they're writing something about Obama, I feel like it's implied... I feel like it's implied that it's gay. You know? How could you be gay and not, and not know Pokemon? Listen, I, I was raised in a very sheltered household. So, I can see this motherfucker being gay. Something about that wide-eyed wonder. Between the two traits, I see that gay is more important. Melton is NB. I can see that. This is the most genderless motherfucker I have ever seen. I have never seen a gender less distinct than than that one. Next up is Oma Star. Oh, I think I hear thunder outside. Let's hope everything holds up. Are we eating this guy? I feel like we're eating this guy. Ugly Nautilus motherfucker. No, he is hella fucking ugly i have not said hella in multiple years he he's very extremely ugly um would he whip his dick out or listen to the podcast though okay okay here's the thing here's the thing we're not judging whether or not you could you could eat them and not die we're judging if they would be tasty when eaten I think this would be nasty. I think this would be bitter. You'd have to pull out all the spikes. I don't think there's anything actually appealing about that. Um, also, the preparation would take a big deal. And Kingor just said they used to be extinct, so maybe we shouldn't eat them. Okay, understandable. I don't think he'd be tasty. I'm not even all that into seafood to begin with. So I think you could eat him, but I don't think you should. You know what I mean? Like, the other ones who are in there look fucking delicious. I want to... Like, every single one of them. Not this one, though. He looks like a bitch. I think Joe Rogan follower with no social media. I think he listens to the Joe Rogan pod. I like that we're just putting the ugly ones up there. God. We've got sort of these, like, skinny, sort of slimy look to the Indecent Exposure ones, and just big and angry for those. Okay, yeah. He does have a classic flash of bows. <laughs> You're right. And he can easily just come, like, right out of the shell, you know? And then go right back in so they can't even say he did it. Ah, the flasher stance is convincing, though. Maybe he'll break the mold, though. You're right. Because he looks like he's surprising someone. He does hate women, but I think that's why he's flashing. You know? Like, he has a lot going on, and not in a good way. Um... I feel like that him listening to the Joe Rogan podcast would cause the indecent exposure. Um, that pose is really getting me. You're absolutely right. I think I'm going to bump him down. I think you're right. Okay. For a minute, I was like, oh my God, we're zooming through these. And then I noticed that it's eight already and I'm not even halfway through the list. <laughs> oh, next up is Wooper. This is the cutest son of a bitch I've ever seen. Look at him! <laughs> oh, he is so cute. 
Oh, he's so little. Gay, gay. Wooper Defo is gay, but closeted. Wooper's nice, tall child. <laughs> yeah. No, you're all right. 100% gay. I like that we're just getting all the cute ones. We're just putting all the cute ones in gay. That is a gay... That is one of the gay middle schoolers who follows me on TikTok, despite me requesting that you be 15 or older to follow me there because of the jokes I make. Um, but they're not rude about it. They're just like really, really quiet and are super careful to not comment on anything. So I won't check their profile and block them. Um, and they probably DM me on Instagram to say that I gave them uh, the encouragement to come out. I say this because like all of that has happened to me at some point this year. <laughs> like. All of them have happened at some point. <laughs> Ooh, thank you for the posture check. Kingo, when I say cute ones, I don't mean fuckable. Licky Licky looks very soft and very friendly. Ooh, y'all better be stretching too, boys. Ah, thank you for the hydrate zone. No, that's what I'm saying. I'm not saying Licky Licky is fuckable. Him having a tongue does not matter. Come on. Of course they're not fuckable. None of them so far are fuckable. Okay. There we go. I don't want to hit my vape on camera. I feel like that makes me a bad example. It makes me a bad example. Although I didn't warn you beforehand, so it did look like I was just escaping the conversation. Okay. Next up. Whooper. Love it. Pun oh, I hate this bitch. I hate this motherfucker. Pineco. It's probably pronounced Pinnaco. The one thing you're worried about is vaping. You know, based on the tier list I'm doing, you're right. I shouldn't worry about it. I really shouldn't worry about it. God, look at this guy. I know he listens to that fucking podcast. I know he listens to that fucking podcast. That is a Joe Rogan fan if I have ever seen one. That looks like somebody's shitty homophobic uncle. Woo, woohoo! You've won the prize for being a piece of raging shit. The anger in his eyes. No. Don't crunch him, Aries. Oh, smooch him is so fucking cute. Look, it's in the name. It's in the goddamn name. We might have our first good kisser, boys. Look how fucking cute she is. This is the cutest mo this is the cutest motherfucker I've ever seen. I think that this is either gay or at least Smoochum is not. Y'all are just downright making shit up now. Cottagecore femme lesbian, are you kidding me? None of the pictures are good is the problem, but this is the one I'm basing it off of. She is definitely not a baby. The leader of the PTA. <laughs> okay, if it's canonically little, okay. God, that's funny. Leader of the PTA. God, that's so fucking funny. I feel like the Pokemon's ages are so fucking ambiguous. But that's gonna get me in trouble saying that. I shouldn't say it. That sounds way worse than I mean it. I think she's a lesbian. We're putting all the pink ones here. I feel like... She's Cottagecore. She's absolutely a cottagecore lesbian. The more I look at her, I'm like, this is a li this is the definition of lipstick lesbian. Hi, Barb. I was told that I can't kiss first evolution Pokemon. So, would you kiss the Pichu? No, no, kiss the Smoochum. Pink. Reading the reading the reading the the pink equals gay comment and then looking up at my at my setup 
and then looking down in shame only to be confronted by my pink keyboard, my pink desk, and my pink mouse is really horrifying. Kid core. That is a good way to describe her. Cheat kisses. No, that's true. Honestly, I feel like for forehead kisses, I really want to put her there. What's Smoochum's evolutions? What? She becomes this motherfucker? Who is that? Jinx? Smoochum becomes Jinx? An opera singer? What? I can see Jinx as a trans icon. Um... I mean, that's not good. Okay. That is, wow, overwhelmingly racist. I hate Reddit. Um, what's her third one, though? I don't, I don't trust Google right now. I'm wondering. Oh, that makes sense, King Aura. There's no third? Okay. No, I was wondering, because they had the last one be, like, sexy, which was confusing, because I was like, there's no fucking way. Like, it was, like, the big, like, pink lady. Not all of them have a third? You know I don't know anything about Pokemon. Like, I told- I told you. I told you that. Okay. Um... I'm gonna move her up for- for forehead kisses. Shuckle is a single stage Pokemon- Shuck. I cannot talk. Shuckle is a single stage evolution. Weezing is only two stage. Okay. Oh! How do you know? Have they just all been categorized, or have there ever been, like, surprise new Pokemon and you didn't know if they were gonna evolve or not? Also, is it like a Doctor Who situation where they have to die before they can do their next evolution, or do they just grow into it? Next up is Gulpin. I also ask those questions in seriousness. I want them answered. I, d I do want those answered. Gulpin. I want to know. I don't know Pokemon, and I want those answered. Now. But I did already forget what they were. Like, are there's... Okay. Okay, sometimes Nintendo will add evolutions in a later generation. Some have had evolutions show up in later games. Some have very complicated evolutions. Don't think any have to die. Okay. Thank you, Kingor. That's really helpful. Um... I'm just, like, reading over the chat right now. They don't have to die to be a certain strength level. Okay. Oh, this looks delicious. <laughs> I saw what the chat was saying. This looks wonderful. This looks really wonderful. Oh, so sometimes you don't know about pre-evolutions. Okay. There isn't... The Apple Pokemon, Applin, is literally on this list. So we are going to eat the shit out of that motherfucker. Um, wait. But the, the little lips. So all I want to do is either eat this bitch or smooch this bitch. They even have precursor like smooching kind of after the Jinx was Larry Oh, Okay, okay, that makes sense. Pikachu got a pre-evolution called Pichu. Oh, that's cute. Um, so this looks like it could be a smoochin, a smoochin Pokemon, because those are sweet little lips. But she can't. No, you're right. You're right. I, I feel like I could pluck it up by the leaf and yeah, like a toothpick. Uh, stop calling the ball hands. Stop bullying Gulpin. Stop bullying Gulpin. It's his first day on the project. It's his first day here. You don't want him to feel unwelcome, do you? Stop it. Stop it. We're giving him a sweet kiss just because you've all been so mean. Maybe if you weren't so mean, he could have been eaten. But instead, I have to kiss him now. Stop it. Piece of shit. You're making this poor boy feel horrible. Next up is hippop hippop hip. So I'm excited for that one. That okay? You know, I don't know what I expected. That's yeah. I mean, that's a hippopotamus. He's just some guy. Indecency. 
gay Obama writer. Y'all are saying a lot of different things for him. Run for office in like Australia. I don't see this as a child. I see this as a grown man. Obama writer or council guy. I can see him as being a prominent member in the church who goes on to get elected to chairman of the board. But at the same time, I can also see him as an Obama fanfic writer. Oh, this is hard. This might be our first Obama writer. Our politicians look like that often. Look at those eyes. He's seen shit, Obama. Okay. Okay. Hippopotamus is our first, our first, uh, smut writer. Okay, next up. Woobat. Woobat, boys. Right, lads. I think this one is cute. I don't think I'll eat it. He writes Obama fanfic, but like at the school library computer while everyone thinks he's studying. Um. Oh, this is Swoobat. The one that I have listed actually Swoobat. So that's that's different. Um, yeah, it is the wrong bat. Woobat, a child. Swoobat, great kisser. Um, no, that's a little baby, but this is the one we're going off. It's actually Swoobat. I just miswrote it. Um, adorable. Adorable. Um, his lips are literally hard shit. Wait, 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 wait. Th that is not lips. That's a nose. You can tell. Because Woobat, that's a nose and then mouth. And that's a nose and then a mouth. Okay. So the teeth might get in the way. But he just looks so goddamn sweet. That he looks so he looks so cute. I would give him a little kiss. <laughs> I would give him kisses. A lot of y'all want a kiss. Are you sure it's not just because you think his nose looks like a mouth? Kiss the little nose. What have teeth ever gotten in the way? I mean the ones that are coming out, like it's gonna poke. It's gonna poke out. That is a butch lesbian. I can see that as well. Oh, the little ears are so cute. I love this motherfucker. He's just, look at him. Look at him, his little, ta his little tails make a heart. Um, I think I wanna give him a little smooch. No, wait, 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 wait. Cause it's not based on whether or not we wanna smooch him. It's based on whether or not they'd be good at smooching us. Just because I think he's cute is not the same thing. Another pastel emo gay. No, wait, yeah. I see bitches like this dress at school. This is a gay. All the all the goddamn cute ones. She, they, butch, lesbian. Yeah. Okay. Next up is a little garbage boy. Nasty little garbage boy. Literally called Trubbish. It's like a combo between trash and rubbish. It's just way worse. And it looks like a fucking trash can. Oh my God, it's Kirby music. This is great. And that's awful. I can trubbish. Um, so this is our boy. I feel like he listens to the podcast. But only because his friends do. I think he's, I think that he's respectful in terms of not doing a decent exposure. Um, but I can see him listening to the podcast because he feels pressured to conform to his friends. Um, yes, exactly. Humor. Joe Rogan, but it's not too late to turn it around. There's hope. Look at his little face. He is not happy with his way of life right now and he wants to grow and he knows there's something more out there, but he can't quite figure out what. Oh, he's definitely an egg. Male wife, give him a little apron. Oh, come on. Look how fucking cute that is. Trubbish by smashing renders on deviant art. This is great fucking art and this makes me think male wife. Oh, he's so over eager. I can't believe I'm sympathizing. Oh, he just gets worse and worse. Ew. Um, fanfic man. I can also see that. That's too cute though. 
I can't. Is this a podcast? Is this is this a podcast listener? No, his evolution's gross, so I don't really want to marry him. But I feel like he could also win a small town election. All right, we're putting this one to a vote, lads. Um, I am going to allow um, bits and points to be used, though, because I don't believe in equality. I don't think I should say that. Where's my Where's my poll? Hey. Hey, where'd my poll go? Hey, you piece of shit. Ugh, Twitch updated and made things more disorganized. Last thing I need. Okay. New poll. What to do with Trubbish? Joe Rogan. Podcast listener. Or small town election. Or fanfic writer. That is possible. That I think is possible. Okay, vote on this one, boys. Let's see how it goes. Um, what are we bringing it for? Hmm. Okay. I feel like somebody is inflating the votes. Okay, yeah, no, very much so. Okay. Um, <laughs> not to be nervous, this is favorite Pokemon of this one lady. He does when she was poor. He was her only friend. She kept him. when she got rich, a bunch of pretty Pokemon on her team. That's so cute. Y'all have like 30 seconds left, by the way. Um, yeah, somehow I, somehow I really get the feeling that the podcast is going to win. 82.58. Ooh, ooh. Fanfic is catching up, boys. Fanfic is catching up. Ooh, wait. Oh, my God. I love watching this unfold. This is so much fun. Oh. Okay. Oh, wait. Fanfic Rider is coming up. 124. Who's going to win? Who's going to pull it out? Who's going to pull it out? 152 to 140. Oh, four points apart. 155 to 151. Joe Rogan Podcast. One. Barb. Did you just delete Zeno for saying that Trubbish's evolution is ugly? Barb, are you silencing Zeno? <laughs> I was like, what? What is happening here? Are you abusing your mod powers? <laughs> you voted small town election because I felt bad. I had no votes. <laughs> That's so cute. That's so fucking cute. Okay, I guess it's a podcast listener. But don't worry, he can turn it around. I'm in a boost, please demote. God damn. Xeno Dragon contributing 3,600 channel points. Insane, my love. Insane. Okay, lads. Next up is Diggersby. Let's see what his deal is. Is he the big bunny? Weird looking bunny. Wait, here we go. <sighs> he looks like he's ready to rip that thing off. He's gonna, he's, he's gonna flash you. He is, he is poised and ready to go. Yes, he would use, Diggersby would use his disgusting arms, his disgusting ear arms to flash people. Diggersby is not gay, he's just a really good ally. Frankly, I don't think he is. That's a bear gate. No. No. I don't like his pose. I don't trust him at all. Arrest that man. Look at this man. I do like his little beard though. I think that's funny. He's dirty and not in a sexy way. <laughs> um, so it's either one of the good ones, gay, or one of the bad ones. Um, I don't trust him. Sorry. Sorry. And listen. I hate this one. You refuse to evolve my Bomby because of him. God, that's funny. I... I feel bad. I feel like I'm really judging them based on appearance. Even though this makes a lot of sense to me. An old-timey prospector holding his huge-ass belt buckle. <laughs> I can see that. I love that so much, Barb. That's incredibly good. Next up is Inteleon. Isn't this that little lizard bitch? 
Like, I'm pretty sure this is that little lizard bitch. Inteleon. He is straight up just Male wife. I'm gonna peg that motherfucker. That's a male wife. That's a male wife. Mm -mm. That's a twink. Oh. No, I'm not saying he's not gay. But that's why I'm gonna make him into a male wife. A bitchy twink, male wife. Yeah. B him being gay is a given. But male wife, that's a unique trait. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna ruin his life, by the way. Like, I'm gonna ruin everything for him. Every bank account he has is mine, even the offshore ones. He thought he could fool me, dumb son of a bitch. I was ten steps ahead of him at all times. Then I made him stay at home, like he always wanted me to stay home and work. Well, guess what, Inteleon? I couldn't come up with a punchline. I'm gonna eat your ass. See? Pulled out of the water. Oh! <laughs> He's so cute. He is so cute. I love him. That's a baby. Um, he does look yummy though. He looks like a marshmallow covered in jello. Becky gets it. I, this is so good. This is so good. Oh God. Um, oh, sorry, I got distracted. Forehead kiss the snom is not binary. Snom is definitely non binary. I will give you that. Um, this is like looking at a little bunny when you eat it. Listen, some people do. Some people do. Um, hey, King Or, that thing you said earlier was really funny, but we can't have that in the chat, and I don't know how to delete it, so... Barb, you should probably- Barb, you should probably- you should probably delete that one, even though it's extremely funny, sorry. Um, I just have to set an example. Um, a marshmallow covered in crystallized sugar. Snom, they she it, you're right. You're right. Like that turtle bread, ooh. God damn. This bitch is looking more and more delicious by the second. Um, it would taste like marshmallow. I, God, their little lips are so fucking cute. This is gay, but also that does, also I'm still going to eat it. Like I'm still, like I'm still going to eat it. So, oh, listen, you don't have to eat them personally. It's just asking, would they be tasty if you cooked them? And you've got to admit, that bitch looks delicious. Incredible. So good. I, uh, yeah, I want to eat that guy. Is there still a mask in my pocket? I thought I put that, I thought I took that out earlier. There is. Stay safe, folks. Well, okay. Many things can be gained out of me for its Becky. In front of God and everyone. Next up is Lotad. Jump softly. Lotad. Which one is that? Oh, look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Oh, he's got he's got a plate on his head. He looks like Perry the Platypus. <laughs> he looks like Perry. Looks so good. He looks like fucking Perry the Platypus just with a different hat on. Ludicolo is the evolution? What is that? Oh, 
overwhelming, but he seems fun. I don't like that he's got a duck beak, though. You would eat him. You would eat off of him. I was gonna say gay, but hear me out. Small town mayor. He has been campaigning for years. He has really worked hard for this position. He is well-intentioned. He is a sweetheart. He runs for office in the same way that town in Canada has a dog for a mayor. You are exactly right. He's just so sweet. Who wouldn't vote him in? Who wouldn't vote in Lotad? Lotad is my governor, not Ron DeSantis. Absolutely. Wow, these are two very different vibes for mayor. He is also gay. Yeah, no, you're right. I like how any of the ones that we like, y'all just immediately decide that they're gay. I had one in a Nuzlocke and Magnus carried out the point. Oh, God. That just... That water bottle just... Water bottle squirted. Anyway. Next up is Ludred. Loud Red? Ludred? I don't know. Anyway, he's ugly. <laughs> Ludred belongs to... I like that you already know. Thank you for the posture check. Ludred... <laughs> oh! Wow! He looks so much worse than I thought. I just noticed how his ears look like speakers, along with his mouth being fucking massive, and his feet being big and good for stomping. Um, Ludred. Okay. Lude... Lude red? You know what that means? That means he's pulling his dick out. I don't know where he's hiding it, but... Joe Rogan, you'd play the podcast. Oh, man, but it's hard to say. Because... <sighs> oh, speakers, sorry. Um, this is hard. I feel like he'd listen to the podcast. I feel like he'd go to jail. Um, someone mentioned the smut fic as well. <sighs> okay. I feel like we can't put all the ugly ones we don't like in these categories, but God, it's tempting, isn't it? Maybe he does write a smut fic. Listens to the podcast in jail. Okay, I hear you, besties. Is he more well-known for the Indecent Exposure or the podcast? Actually, someone in chat said it. But now that I'm thinking about it, I'm, like, increasingly convincing myself. He only got four teeth. Obviously, he doesn't brush his teeth. He lost too many. It is my tier list. I do get to do what I want. Feet teeth. Oh, my God. You're right. What? Oh, my God. What? He lit He has teeth on his feet. That did not occur to me. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Joe Rogan anti-abortion shows to yell at the clinic. Yeah. I don't want to see him. I feel like we are spending a lot of time. This is him in action. He's playing the podcast. He would demand that you debate him. I thought he was excited in the top one, but no, he's just being a bitch. That's a Joe Rogan listener. Okay. Okay. He is just screaming, not listening to anyone. He has claws in his mouth. Those are not claws. Come on. Middle of a three-stage whisperer and explode, explode. His worst whisper is better. Okay, understood. I'm so scared of accidentally exiting out of this because I did that earlier and it was really tragic. God, the Kirby music makes this, doesn't it? Okay, next up is Sableye. Who is that? I think this is a little, a little scampy one. Oh, he's a little scamp. Gay. <laughs> Just here, go put in the chat. Gay, 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 gay. Send him to gay jail. Gay, gay, gremlin gay, gremlin gay. He is a nasty little motherfucker. I love him. Wow, he's the fucking worst. He reminds me of Stitch. He has gems for eyes. Would he write a smuff? He would write a, sm a smut fic, ironically. Ironically. Um, oh, he, she pronouns, you're right. Not mind if I've ever seen one, Zayza. All are good. There's definitely not just one gender in this bitch. He would write the fic. I think that they're gonna write the fic, yes, to troll people. Oh, 
notorious internet troll, oh my god, has somehow managed to convince the majority of the Wattpad community that their fix are genuine, and that has caused a lot of uproar as far as, like, what kind of moderation Wattpad should start to, to institute. Exactly, definitely a gender or gender fluid. That's a smutfic writer, just because they're an internet troll. Next up is Whiskash. You better have money involved, but somehow I feel like you won't. Whis Cash. Zay wants the clout. They'd ask people to read the new fic and watch as they read in horror. Troll, but I'm gonna I'm gonna write a full crack fic and not I'm gonna dock someone. No, you're right. Oh. Lovely. Lovely. I wanna take this handsome young man out to dinner. He looks lovely. That is, I think, a male wife, if not a mayor. I can see mare or male wife. Gay, but also edible, but also kissable. That stash is very much giving. Friendly gay dad. I think this fish's mouth is too big. Older gay who acts as a father figure for the community. Also valid, also valid. Man, this is hard. I feel like this one's really difficult. Um, either small town election, male wife, or gay. Um, should I put up a poll? Do you guys want to help me vote on this? Whiskash. Whiskash. I can't spell. I'll put up the poll if you promise to, um, use bits to, to blow up the votes. Because there's a specific one I want, but... And I, I promise I'm not rigging it. I'm not saying we should rig it. But I know you're all very opinionated boys. He does run for office, but legitimately only does it because his kids get him to. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I don't think that not having thoughts behind the eyes makes him disqualified for mayor. I legitimately think that that is almost a plus. Especially, if this is a small town, I think that is going to make him admirable and relatable. He seems well-intentioned. He doesn't have enough thoughts behind his eyes. Stop voting gay. I want male life. Bitches. God. <laughs> Sorry, that was really mean. I love you. Um... I think he would seem trustworthy because he can only have one thought in his eye and it, it what he can only have one thought in his mind in his head at a time and every and every day that thought is just be good mayor no room for treachery no spare thoughts for lies he only has a single thought behind his eyes that's my man shit I managed to convince myself that he should be a mayor instead of a male wife fuck Fuck! I rigged the votes for male wife and then convinced myself he should be mayor. Fuck! I made up a little rhyme and everything. I just dropped a good 4K po What? That is so many. Male wife for a mayor. Male wife for a mayor. How did I fuck that up? I just managed to convince myself of the opposite choice. He's mainly male wife. Second mayor. I really played myself King Or. Stevie, put him in a small town office. Fuck the poll. Barb. Barbara. Miss Barb. Not Honora. You would not be saying that. If you had voted for male wife, you'd be insisting that I play by the rules. Only a good mayor because he's such a male wife. Maybe he's a male wife. Um, while his partner goes off to be mayor. He holds down the home fort. That I can see as well, though. Male wife for mayor. Vote now. I love my partner, my town, but mostly my partner. <laughs> yes, is breaking the rule of efficacy. I'm all for it. <laughs> I'm going to put him as male wife. Because I love my viewers. He cares more about appeasing his partner than being a good mayor, but still loves being there. I can see that.
I think that he would stick with his partner. Like his, he would support the home front while his partner was uh, was was mayor. But maybe secede the throne. That marriage don't work in hierarchies. He cares more about appeasing his partner than being a good mayor. He make a killer tray bake. <laughs> Actually, I can see that. I'm glad we didn't want to eat him. Happy male life. Happy man life. <laughs> happy male life. That's okay. Happy male wife, happy male life is me and Shiloh. I've got to text them that. Hold on. Hold on. Oh my god, look. Shiloh's sister just sent them a picture of their childhood cat, Bebo. Look how fucking cute. Look how fucking cute that is. I'm gonna cry. I just showed this on stream. Everyone say hi to Bebo. I'm gonna credit you, Becky. Shut up. God. Needy. I love you, Becky. That was mean. Also in chat, Becky just said. Happy male wife. Happy male life. Male. Ma I can't spell. And that equates our relationship. Is that Yui Ouch? Yes! Shy, you remembered! Yes, BB or Bebo or Mookie Babu um, is the one who bit Shiloh. Oh, Becky. Okay. Okay. <laughs> the worst. Don't make me active on stream in front of God and everyone. <laughs> and then Barb, Becky, stop doing horny. <laughs> oh my God. Got me all distracted now. Where the fuck is my vape? Oh God. Oh God, my foot just got all, t oh my God. My foot got all tangled up in the cord that scared the fuck out of me. Okay, who's next? Oh, Phoebus. God, y'all gonna wanna eat Phoebus so bad. Hold on. Right, boys. Phoebus is food. My Lodic is a lesbian. Let's look at my Lodic. I want to see that real quick. I like it when the evolution names kind of match up with the original names. I think that's really fun. My Lodic. Why is she so sexy? Come on. She's so sexy and for what? Phoebus, however, is edible. Hi, Bubba. Everyone, Shiloh's here. I just showed off um, Bebo on stream and everyone really, really liked her. And Cheyenne said, is that Iwi Ouch? That is Iwi Ouch. It's thrilling, excuse me. Consume that fish. Um, have we introduced Evie to Gardevoir? No, I don't know what that is. That's the garden one that everyone wants to fuck. Everyone wants to, wants to fuck a garden one? Unless that's funny. There's a Pokemon that everyone wants to fuck. I think it's either Evie or Gardevoir. Yeah, no, they Oh, they she's one. a fancy little lady. She's really fun. Um, do you want to, um, do the stream while I go pee? Yeah. Yeah? So do I just pick the next Pokemon? Oh. Oh, well, I was just going to have you chat with chat. Yeah? Yeah? Chat, ask Shiloh questions. Ask him would you rathers. Give him stuff to chat about. Can I place a Pokemon in the tier just one? You can place a Pokemon in the in the in the tier. Thank you so much. Leslie. I love you. <coughs> oh god. I love you. Okay, you just had so much juice. Don't worry, I want 
I'm. <laughs> yeah. I'm. My roommate is pissing, so I decided to take over for a little bit. Um, not the Pokemon hentai. I know! Very bad stuff. Have you played Sonic and Sega All-Stars Racing yet? No, I actually haven't. I've been meaning to get that one. I think it's on the Switch. Um, I've recently been playing through, um, what is it? Sonic Mania again, and it's so fucking good. Would I rather fight 100 ducks or 25 geese? Honestly? I'll go with 100 ducks, because instead of fighting them, I feel like I would just give up and be like, if it's my time, it's my time, God. Take me. And then I would just let the ducks kill me. Um, hi guys! Third bar and goth to tell our peak pastel goth color. I believe you! Um, oh my god, they were <laughs> roommate heresy! <laughs> How's my day been? It's been pretty good, thanks for asking, Cheyenne! Um, I had class, and then I came home, and ate some leftovers from Robotos, and then, what did I do? And then I played, um, Saints Row, which is super fun! Um, good answer, Duck are powerful. They really are! Um, I'm doing pretty good. People you know cats or dogs. Honestly, I do love both, especially little dogs, but I have to say cats. Um, I feel like reading the Warriors series as a kid just made me hyperfixate on that to a disproportionate amount. Um, do we take song requests? Um, you know, I would, but I don't even know. Like, I feel like I would like mess something up with the stream if I were to put on a song, so I'll ask Stevie when he comes back. Oh, my favorite food? That is definitely Sketty. Or really just any kind of pasta with red sauce. Um, and burgers. Those are my two comfort foods and they make me very happy. Favorite type of bread? Ooh. On like my regular sandwich, I like wheat. Um, but I do really like the fancy cottage bread that Stevie makes. It's very good. He's very good at baking. Favorite Sega character? Gotta be Shadow. Gotta be Shadow. Um, I know that Sega had a mascot before... Oh, you're good. <laughs> I know that Sega had a mascot before they decided Sonic was, and he was like a little like chicken butt guy or something, and he's really cute. Right? Um, my favorite color is definitely green, like sage green. It used to be chartreuse, um, which is hideous, but I loved it. Do I like apples? I do like apples. Um, I know there's like a jillion different breeds of apples, they just make them punch and they come out with new ones, but... I don't know, I like the red ones. <laughs> CB Baker Man, he really is- Yeah, Billy Hatcher! Oh my god, I didn't think anyone would like recognize what I was talking about. Him! Yeah, I definitely, like, played one of the, um, games that they made with him. I have, like, a Sonic and Sega, like, all-star collection or whatever. Um, <laughs> they come out with apples. I swear they do. They're just in the labs at Monsanto, just making new fucking apples all the time. It's exhausting. Let's see what Pokemons I want to put on this tier. Oh, I don't know any of their names. I recognize this guy. He's Mr. Mime. Let's see. He looks a little scary. I feel like... Let me think. I feel like he does um, drink alcohol to do a proportion amount. I feel like it's kind of affecting his life badly. Um, and he's balding, so he's definitely older. He's not giving me gay, he's giving me Republican. Hmm. He definitely listened to the Joe Rogan podcast on that. I definitely wouldn't cook him. I feel like he would taste like batteries. So I just wouldn't do that. <gasps> no, he would get arrested for indecent exposure. He's so scary. I definitely will put him there. Oh god, how do I do this? There I go. I've done it. It's me, the stream master. This is great. Oh, these are so cute. CV, um, when he was preparing for the stream, he was going through all the names of the Pokemons, and I thought it was very interesting. Oh no, CV's bringing a chair to bash me in the head with. Help! No, no! Help! No! <laughs> Help! Call 7-Eleven! Hold on, I gotta got got put the Cheetos down. Oh, thank you. There you go. Anyone care for a Cheeto? Mmm. Delicious, wasn't it? These are stale. We actually found them under our couch when we, we just, moved in. We just ordered them from GoPuff. <laughs> you piece of shit. We actually found them under our couch when we moved in, and a friendly roach handed it to us. That is a lie. That and we is were like, slanderous. And we were like, oh, thank you so much. So now we have infinite Cheetos from the friendly couch roach, and it's great. And where did your home Cheetos come from? Anyway. Oh my um, god. <laughs> Mr. Mom marries your mom, if I believe. He was a little bad. Mr. Mom, did him. you fuck my mom? That's so funny. It's like dog breeds. Exactly. Apples are like dog breeds. What? They asked me if I like apples or not. Oh. Mr. Mime is a gay Republican who claims he manages to turn himself straight. Exactly! You get the vibe. He's balding do like from all the stress of pretending to not be gay. You know, we've all been there. I love this little man. That's fair. You just got dinner. Good on you for eating, Aries. I support you. Steel Cheetos, nice. I know they're my favorite kind. Sometimes with my Cheetos, 
I like to soak them in a vat of water before I eat them. You are so bullshit. And then put them in the you microwave. Stop lying on the internet. <laughs> That's Charlie Cheeto, the couch roach. Exactly. Oh my gosh, you must have met him too. He's very friendly. Did you see the quote uh, uh, texted you from Becky? I don't think so. I, it was a modified Becky quote. Um, happy male, happy male life, happy male life, and I think that's like, yeah. A relationship. Oh, you did send me that. It really does. I also love the puppy Cheetos. My problem is I really like them, and like I love the way they taste so much, but they also sometimes give me like a sensory issue, and it's really confusing. Charlie Cheeto's a gay ally. He is. If we were straight, instead of giving us the Cheetos, he would have bit us. It's true, which honestly, admirable. Um, you hate them? That's fair. That's fair. They're not for everyone. Do you want to do the lottery check? Yeah. I got a salt place with you. You got what? I got a salt place with you, though. Yes. I'm trying to get that to fit there. I hope I did a good job. You did a great job, Bubba. Thank you so much. You're still on stream. Oh, I forgot to close the door. That's on me. I'm so sorry. Okay, my roommate's back. <sighs> <laughs> I don't know why I'm worried about you closing the door and we literally live together. <coughs> like, no one else is coming home. Charlie Cheeto, baby. I do wonder if we have ghosts. Um, I don't think so, so far. This, seems, this place seems pretty unhaunted. Yeah, no evidence yet other than, like, our, um, <coughs> our missing HelloFresh boxes. I mean, yeah. otherwise. The oh, don't worry. Shallow is still here. Just gotta move over a little bit. This song goes extremely hard, though. There we go. Okay, boys. If you're bitten by Charlie Cheeto, you turn into a Cheeto every full moon. This is good. We're getting so, we're getting really good lore in for Charlie. We are. Yeah. I'm so glad that we are. Uh -oh. There we go. Yeah. There we go, boys. You're so cute. Hmm. You're adorable. Yeah. And I'm finally finding a way where we can both be in frame. Me too. Stellar stuff. Okay. Oh, we did put Mr. Mime up for indecent exposure. Honestly, I 100% agree with that. Thank I you. feel like he could probably fool a small town to win an election. I was thinking that. But he's probably going to get arrested for indecent exposure uh, later. Yeah, I either put him there. So. I was going to put him there or a uh, Joe Rogan podcast. You got it. You absolutely got it. Mm -hmm. I um, trust him. So we put Phoebus in Gotta Eat Him, right? <laughs> We did. We did. We said it'd be tasty if cooked. So we did Mr. Mime. What the fuck is Crowagunk? Never heard of. Crowagunk? Okay, time to see. Crowagunk. He literally has gunk in his name. Ew! Oh, he's just like a frog, I guess. I don't trust him. Shy said Crowagunk is indecent. Listens to Joe Rogan, but has the yearn to change. It's pronounced Krogonk. Yeah, I said that. Um, Incel. Ah, yeah. I can see him being a Joe Rogan listener or Indecent Exposure. I can see it too. Actually, do you think he would write Obama smut fic? <laughs> you know, I think he would. I could also see him doing that. <laughs> that is a Reddit user. <laughs> I did say Krogonk the first time. Krogunk is a Krogunk, sorry, is a feminist. He's always stopping Brock from hitting on random women. I believe it. I believe it. Brock Obama? One of the creepy gamer dudes. He's probably trying to change, and he probably legitimately believes that he is a nice guy. Um, He's giving me Birdly. Not Birdly. Y'all seen Deltarune yet? Mm -hmm. We've been watching that shit. It's great. Um, what is he? Oh, Obama. <laughs> Those are Obama writers so far. Emo podcast. A lot of them were realizing that they... Um, they fit multiple categories. Usually it's gay in another category, and they always <laughs> just want me to put them automatically in gay, and I'm like, they have other they have other important traits, you know? Exactly. Don't define a bisexuality, you pieces of shit. Yeah, we do always know that one 16-year-old that we just pray grows out of it. I Oop. agree, Becky. And sometimes we were the 16-year-old. <laughs> oh, God, I don't trust him. Oh. That's a podcast listener. I'm a little scared of him. At the same time, he could be a nice dad. We don't have a dad category. Runs for office, though. Politician. Mm. Don't Probable trust him. for city council. Uh, you're right. I think he does. That's a bear gay. <laughs> I think he is a politician. I can see that. I feel like he does listen to the podcast, but I think he's a politician first. Yeah. 
small town election, baby. He only stops tweeting about the podcast once he starts running for office. God, that's fine. He has to have another passion project. Mm -hmm. Turns out he's just really neurodivergent, doesn't really know how to handle himself. Damn. Oh, you still have that note up? Yeah. I had a little note of what I needed to make of the silo in Stardew Valley, and then Shiloh wrote on the bottom of it, I love you, as a little heart. Um, and so I kept it. I also still need it for the stuff that's on there, but I also probably wouldn't get rid of it because I know it's extremely cute. That's so cute. Yeah. I was like, where should I put it? And I was like, I'm gonna put it where I can see it. Now I will play with fire. Do not. Hey. <laughs> Stop acting up on the street. <laughs> you guys are so cute, vlogs. Couple passes the member of the city council. You expect to be super vanilla, and then his husband picks him up from work one day. Yeah, actually, I can see um, that. Um, I can see that too. Scraggy is up next. Oh, that sounds so cute. Wait, is this who I'm thinking of? Monster Kid from Undertale. I love him. That looks exactly like Monster Kid. He looks like a friend. Like, that's, that's Monster Kid. Like, that has to be based on him, right? Okay, ask yourself. Mm. Do you love him, but would he also be delicious if cooked? No. He has, I can see the whites of his eyes. Too sentient. Fair. He has feelings. Obomnific, an annoying little snot. Scraggy is edible. He does look like just a neurodivergent little eight-year-old. He does. Um, Scraggy spends 15 minutes telling you a story that can <laughs> take one. That sounds like me. I'm Scraggy. I, I wasn't going to say it, but I love you. <laughs> I'm Scraggy. Some people are saying smutfic writer. I can see that. I wish I had a neurodivergent category. He's very popular on AO3. Hmm. Scraggy's envy. A lot of people are saying gays. All listen, the gay ones are just like pink, cute. That's it. Pink, yeah. blue, or cute. I look like that. Mm-hmm. Right now we have a nice little trans flag going on. Oh my god, mm -hmm. you're right. He's very self-conscious about his writing, so he does Obama fanfic so his friends think he's joking about getting into writing so they don't call him a nerd. Oh my god, that's exactly what I did. Yeah. But no. I didn't write Obama fanfic. You did? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> I know that Scraggy was made pre-Undertale. What I'm wondering is if Toby Fox based Monster Kid off of Scraggy, which I actually would find incredibly possible since his games are heavily influenced by his other games. Is that a... This cheetah looks like a weenie. Yo, this cheetah looks like a weenie, you guys. <laughs> I don't want to eat it now. Should we preserve it and like put it in a picture? <laughs> that was my family heirloom. <laughs> Piece of shit. <laughs> right, boys. <laughs> His best of all is the purchase of a belt. You understand, y'all, if your weenie looks like that, go see a doctor. <laughs> <laughs> um, Scraggy goes to jail for violent reasons, not indecent reasons. I agree. Steven eats weenie, you hold it here first. <laughs> God, this this camera's having a real hard time adjusting to the two of us. God it damn. It really is. That's racism, though. Racist fucking camera. Right? Right? I just can't lean forward or else it starts <laughs> shining off of my, like, it does. greasy ass forehead. And I just get washed out. It's like you're like a beacon of light suddenly. Right. Skaggy is a <laughs> Skaggy. I'm never making fun of anyone when they make typos. They're just always funny. It's always funny. Toby Fox recycles some of his Homestuck music for the Pokemon theme. He wrote, That's true! Mm. He recycles some Homestuck music for Pokemon and some Homestuck music for Undertale. And he recycled some of his Earthbound ROM that he made, Halloween hack some of that for Undertale as well. Cool. Insane. Also, don't watch the Halloween hack. It's not very good. He was trying extremely hard to be edgy and it did not work. You know, we all have that face. It was also just like badly paced. He set the difficulty level way too high, which definitely did not carry over into any of his later games. Mm. Skaggy does look like a homo, but I think that he also writes smuck about Obama, but he'll grow out of it. Let me, let me yeah. clarify. These first three, we decided that those two unironically do it as adults. This middle one is just a little gremlin who does it because, like, they're an internet troll. Yeah. And, like, they do it just to make their friends mad. Um, I see. And Skaggy's just neurodivergent. Skaggy's just a neurodivergent teen who doesn't really know how to cope. I love him. He will grow out of it. He will make fun of himself for it later, but there will be a few years where he thinks, this is the secret I take to my grave. Is that me? Yeah. Yeah. Um, every few years, I come up with a new secret I'm taking to my grave, and I will eventually tell whoever's close to me. Usually that's Shiloh. Um, <laughs> but... I recently got a new one. I just thought of a new one, so I'll tell you that later. I'm excited. Yeah. Carablast. Carablast. I bet it'll look like a carrot. 
I don't think it will. I feel like maybe it's a lightning type. I like trying to predict. Oh, because blast? That makes sense. Yeah. Oh. He looks like a little fish motherfucker, but he also looks like angry, like he's gonna bite your little ankles. Mic is right there. Oh. You're closest to the mic. Did anyone hear that? I hope y'all couldn't hear that. You're gonna be banned from twitch.tv forward slash dv underscore b. Is that what you want? Is that what no. you want? Is that what you fucking want? He does look like a bug. I feel like I could eat him though. <laughs> yeah. Although he's really cute. He just looks like a silly little guy. He is cute. He kind of reminds me of Lancer. He looks like a cute mezzapap. Um. If I remember correctly, he's just a bug type. I don't think he could kiss very well. No. I, he doesn't seem very nasty. Hmm. Maybe cooked. Yeah, he does kind of look. He does kind of look edible. He does kind of look edible. Do you think he writes a bomb effect? I don't think so. I don't think he's ever heard of it. All right, and Becky wants to squish him, which is fine. Um, <laughs> I could see him being gay, but only because he's cute. He's a leg chomper. Yeah, he looks like something you'd eat on vacation. You don't eat it often. Do you think that he would run for mayor right out of college and immediately fail? Kind of. He's, like, idealistic. He's young. Kara Blast writes fanfic because others told him to. He does make me think tasty. You're right. It might be the colors. And he's shaped like a fish, even though I know he's a bug type. Yeah, he does look kind of tasty. I would eat him. Runs for student council. That um. is student council president. Oh my god, you're right. Mm. Yes, he's absolutely a very a very little politician. Very little. He trains for this his whole life. You're 100% right back. He's gonna win the fifth grade election, and I'm really excited for him. Yeah. I ran for president of the fifth grade once, and then another girl won, and I got secretary, but the only reason that she won was because she promised that in the winter they would set up hot chocolate stands. I wanted to build my whole thing on integrity and not lying, because oh. the candidate I voted for the previous year uh, lost to somebody who gave up a bunch of false promises. And I complained to my parents, because that didn't seem very fair. Um, they were like, no, it's not, but sometimes that's how politics works. Sometimes people lie to get what they want. Um, and then I was like, wow, that's fucking crazy. I hate that. Luckily, if I emphasize that I build my campaign on integrity, people will vote for me because they trust me. Turns out, they still voted for the person who lied and we had no hot chocolate that winter. That's kind of how it still works. That's how it still works! It sounds really good, and then it doesn't happen. And that was... And that was when I first became disillusioned with politics. I also... Um, swore off competition for a year, for a year, fuck, for a few years because of, uh, my crippling rejection sensitive dysphoria. So, anyway, he's gonna win the student council. I just like monologuing. You do. You just like what they said in the chat where it's like he tells a story that could last one minute but last five. <laughs> Listen, current state does not help. Right. right so. Right. That looks like a fucking steak. You can't you can't be non-literal with me. I was like Florida. <laughs> I have autism. <laughs> Fuck. I said steak. I thought you said state. Not state. I thought you said state as in um consummation of that. You know? God. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he looks just edible. Mm-hmm. Or punchable. I just kinda wanna. You know? His little beak makes this more complicated. Oh, well, oh he's kind of cute in that picture. He looks, he looks like he'd, a little silly here. He looks like he'd do your tax as well. Mm. Or he'd help you launder money. He's just a little guy. I don't think he can think, though, actually. Yeah, I'm going to eat him, though. He's not sentient. No, I would just eat him. You can't trust any politicians, even if they seem trustworthy. I trust Lotad with my life. We determined that Lotad would be an amazing mayor. This one Aww. looks like Perry the Platypus with a big ass lily pad on his head. He would be amazing. He would give us everything he promised. Right? I literally hate this fish so much. Stun fist my beloved. Damn loathed. I'm gonna eat him. Yeah, that's what I would do. I'm gonna invite you over for brunch. He looks like a he looks like a pancake. Pokemon for brunch. Give me some of that H two O. You are so rude to me. I love you. Yeah. Did we have a JPEG of Mr. Mime? Okay, good, we did. <laughs> Some of them got double. All the ones that have opaque backgrounds also have doubles that are PNGs. I don't know why they oh. did that, but. I thought the ones that um, had the white background were just bisexual. Were what? They were just bisexual. Okay, heard. I did hear you right the first time. Yes. 
Next up is Gumi. Oh, I bet it'll be cute. Who the fuck is Gumi? Gumi. You get it, bae. I want to type it. Okay, go ahead. Aww. I You're want so one. I want one. Gumi does look gay. Gumi looks a little like pudding, but his eyes are too cute. He's the leader of GSA. Not the leader of GSA. He does, he does look gay. He does. But I do also really want to eat him. Oh, no, he's a friend. I support you either way, but damn. He looks like a little, he looks like a little pudding. Where's your pink drug? Oh, in my pocket, I was really confused. Thank you. Gummy bear, but like snail. This looks like a fun novelty shaped gummy candy. Oh, it kind of does. Why are you doing it off screen? Oh. I'm a good influence, Bay. Sorry. It's okay. It's kind of a joke, because I've done it on screen before anyway. It's gamer setup sensing. Stop. Oh. <laughs> no, I'm not bragging or encouraging it. Don't. No, for real, don't do it. Just kidding. Don't. Gumi. Don't get into the team. Um, is gummy candy cookable, or would you eat alive? Um, gummy candy definitely starts as a liquid and later be f like becomes solid. So I'm pretty sure cooking it or like baking it is still involved. Fair. Um, Gumi. He's really cute. I can't believe you'd eat him. This is hard. He's he's just gay. Is he gay or edible? He's I gay. Think he's both. See, like you would tr you would like try to eat him, and then he'd just be so cute in my set. You just wouldn't. Gumi's like super slimy, not tasty. I disagree. Jello is very slimy and quite pleasant. Jello is not good. Is the slime literally acid though? Do you hear? Do you hear what you sound like? I don't care about their types. I'm gonna eat them. I'm gonna put them in my fucking mouth. Gay and edible. Earlier, Becky made a joke that um, that they're gay. And yeah. You would Aren't make that joke. Aren't we all? <laughs> it's slime. Look at his final evolution. I'm not rating a final evolution. I'm rating current gummy, gum, gum, gummy, not gumby. And gumby. I want to put him in my mouth. No, he's too cute. Okay, okay. Exactly. I'm leaving him. I'm leaving. That's what I said. You're right. The second I started to put him there, I felt cripplingly guilty. Exactly. Crabominable. Crabominable. Oh, he looks like a silly guy. Own oh, happy. Okay, go ahead. He can melt a person. Oh, he's very large. That is crab shaped. He's, I mean, he's an abominable crab. Yeah. Big paws. Cute little fountain hairstyle. Is it giving bear, which is giving gay? Big ass feet. Oh, yes. I can see him as being a homo. Right, right. No Punchy. gender. <laughs> He does look punchy, Aries. You're that's right. punchy. I like that. Our first non petite. Actually, no, I, that's a lie. These two are not petite. We've yeah. already been inclusive. I was so worried about it, but these these two. All shapes are somewhere. gay. All shapes is gay. Just so you know. Indeed. A homo with absolutely no style. A homo who Queer Eye does come to I'm visit. I'm very excited for this guy. Oh, yeah. Uh, and they absolutely turn his ass around. It's thrilling. Next up is Choodle. Choodle, that sounds cute. Do you want to type it? Yeah. You're so cute. I'm helpful. Okay. Oh, Aww. he's cute. I look like that you when, do. when you don't let me do what I want. Yeah. Her. He, you can, you can tell he has the loudest fucking mouth. He's like those little dogs that like always have the dirty noses and they're really loud. <sighs> yeah. You know. An office man who's very homo. Oh, I can see. I can that. see him being a terrible boss. Yeah. I wouldn't even say that. I'd say a peon in the corporate culture. Think so. Choodle writes fanfic and listens to podcasts. Oh, Choodle does write the fanfic. I feel like he does have very solid morals. And you can't tell if he's genuine or not. He watches Joe Rogan to be like his father. That makes me so cripplingly sad. No, anyway, you're right, though. You're right. He's like a middle schooler who like really wants to be like his old man, but the problem is that he started in, like in, uh, inter... Internalizing. Internalizing. I was going to say interpreting. Internalizing this stuff like way too early. Thank you for that. Um, mm -mm, yeah, mm -mm, this is sad. Mm -mm. He still has time to turn it around, just like Trubbish. He will. He will. Hopefully they'll find each other in, like, a Facebook group for Joe Rogan fans. And they'll kind of <laughs> together. Facebook group for sons Applin. of dads who like Joe Rogan. Applin is 100% fucking that? edible. A-P-P-L-I-N. Oh, 
hundred percent edible. That is an apple. That's it's it. really cute, though. That's it. It is just an apple. That's just an apple. Yo, he's, he's too cute. cute. You hear a dummy sound. I'm putting him in a pie. Shut he up. is too cute. Don't His eyes look pie. like seeds. No, look at the baked apple. It's okay. Hold on. There look at the baked apple. That's that really cute. looks so fucking tasty. No, he's a friend only. Cute, but also delicious. He does have a little worm tail. He does have a little worm tail. Do you want the worm that's nasty? Appleton the Evolution is a fucking pie. Like, he's literally a pie. He is literally modeled after food. A pie that's a friend. Too bad. I'm going to scoop him out and put him in a pastry. Oh my goodness. I can't believe you. He is modeled after food. I don't know what you expect me to do in these circumstances. I'll mourn him for the rest of my days. Yeah. Yes. Um, rant. Oh, also, I forgot to tell you that I updated the sub goal for Stinky Scared Boy Plays Fanat. Um, <laughs> because Halloween is coming up, and I did kind of start wanting to actually play it, even though it would be very scary. Um, so I did lower the sub goal from 66 to 50. Um, but then, actually, I lowered it to, like, 40, and then Becky started, like, spamming subs, and it got way too close to it way quickly. So then I upped it back to 50. Um, so the only streams we have left, because it ends right before October starts. Um. So we have this stream and Thursday stream. To hit the goal of 50, we're at like 34 right now. I was really upset because they put it at 68% instead of 69. Oh, that's fudged up. Really upsetting. Oh, Becky, right on time. Oh, Solar Puff is actually one who said that. Please, sir. Please, sir. Please, sir. Any spare subs? Please, sir. And get the boost. Any spare subs for support offer, boys? Thank you, Madu. We have a home to run, a FNAF to play. I got you. Please, sir. Please. I love you. I want to get scared shitless. Please. I got you. <laughs> You're just like backing me up like a hype man. Also, Did I Becky, help? fuck off. Fuck off, Becky. I am not a cheater because I had already dropped it. I dropped it from 66 to 40 and then back up to 50, which is still lower than 66. You know what, hun? You know what, hun? I get the feeling. I have an inkling, a feeling that you don't want to play Snap. <sighs> and I will be there to play it with you so that you will not have the heebie jeebies. I actually appreciate that a lot. I love you. Or I can even just play it and then you do all the commentating with the headset on. And I am simply the beacon of play. Actually, either of those options sound very good. Okay, once again. Please, sir. Any spare subs? Any spare subs? Wait, I wonder. No, I'll ask you. Any please. of them? Any, please? I don't know. Any, please? Thank you very much. I don't know. Am I helpful? Address. You are helpful. Thank you. Want to type in Cramorant? Yes. Is that a new favorite tick? Yes, I love that one. It's a fan favorite. Cramorant. Oh, oh, that's not good. Okay. okay, okay, okay. I thought it was cute, and then, <laughs> and then, Cramorant. What do you think of him, babe? <laughs> he looks edible. Yeah. I just want to move past. It. <laughs> the internet is a very bad place. Like first two results too. Oh, someone said male wife. Male wife. Housewife. He does just look like he'd do whatever you'd say. Yes, one hundred percent. Very brainless, but only because he likes being bossed around. Wow, I guess. I guess. I guess. More than Pikachu did. Great. Okay, well, we're. Okay. Let's just focus on the positives. Hmm? Anyway, um, Kramerit. What do you think? I don't like those. Um. What's with the four? <laughs> I could see this being a male wife. <laughs> yeah. I was gonna say eat him, but like, those eyes. Well, he looks like he's modeled after a pelican, and I don't think you should eat those either. Oh, that's fair. What's with the boar, the Cheetos, when we eat them? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I Literally just Literally has a fish in its mouth when battling. This bitch comes with free fish? Shit. That is kind of convenient. Mm-hmm. See, I'm gonna eat like a cat does. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm being distracting. You're getting a bad ear treatment. I love you. I should not have brought you in. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. I don't think he's well intentioned enough to be with these. I'm eating him. Okay. I decided. Was... I just. I don't like his vibes, and I don't want him in my home. I respect that. Next up is impotent baby. Aren't we all? Oh, I'm sorry, my bad. It's okay. It's 
spits out the fish to inflict damage when it faints. Oh my god, that's a gay. Wow. Wow, that is a raging homo. I feel like I kind of encompass that energy. Yeah, you really do. Wow, raging homo. He looks like he bit people in elementary school. Oh yes, 100% did. I wow. love him. Whatever. They're so besties. Oh, they're besties. They're, okay, great. Well, they're really cute. Um, yeah, I I love him. I love him too. He's I a bestie. Really love him. He's a he's a gay bestie. Gay, 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 gay. Oh my god, he's like the gay that like when you're in PE and you're walking the mile when you're told to run it, he's the um person that walks it with you. That's so sweet. He hisses at people in school. He barked at people in middle school. I did yeah. used to hiss in middle school, so I've did. been there. I've been there. What do I say? I don't remember. Milsery. This one is literally just a fucking drop of milk. Okay. Oh. Um, Gus Johnson and Nick is not green said that he they called him a little cum boy. I'll cut straight to it. They called him a little cum boy. Well, you can say that, but I can say the other thing. Fucker. I feel like one's less exclusive. <laughs> Milsery. <laughs> That's a boba. Yeah. With milkshake. Mil good milkshake. No, he's a friend that you keep in a cup so he's safe. Oops. Oh, come boy edible. Becky. <laughs> Look at it. He's so little. Canonically edible. According to Max von Cannon. You can't eat him. Oh, look at his Pokemon card. Look. Look right there. That's so cute. That is exceedingly adorable. You can't be mean to him and eat him. He does have the color of oatmeal. You must refrain. There's different flavors of him. Oh? <gasps> I'm going to cry. That's fucking adorable. See, he's a bestie. No, that looks delicious. He's a bestie. I'm the pink one. You're the blue one. Blueberry. That's so cute and very heteronormative of you. It's because the pink one's really cute. Oh, yeah? And the blue one's too ugly? No. That's why I'm that one? No, I'm just starting fights. I love you. Yeah. I probably would pick the same. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you are. Yeah, you are. Yeah, he looks like whipped cream and fruit. I'm gonna eat his ass. Put him in a cup for safety, but then you accidentally drink him anyway. Like one accidentally drinks a paint water cup. Bro, the way that would absolutely decimate my mental health. Then like, you go into mourning for like 90 days. Literally, like as soon as I meet him, he cures my mental illness. I am neurotypical. And then I drink him again, and it just all comes flooding back. That'd be terrible. I can't believe this shit. That'd just be terrible. Turns out he's been emotionally manipulating you to. <laughs> Sorry, should not have made you laugh. Emotion manipulating you to be to be dependent on him. You know, whatever works. <laughs> Just kidding, kids. Don't get in those situations. Don't do that. Yeah. Don't do that. Bad for your psyche. Drink his old baby. Oh god. Becky said one time I accidentally drank a water cup being used as an ashtray. Oh god. That is terrifying. One time as a kid I drank a water cup that just had like rubbing alcohol in it. Oh god. Like why was it in a cup, you guys? What the fuck is this bitch doing? Whoa, I trust him. I would be his bestie. That's a that's a wife. That kind of has your energy. Thank you so much. Kind of does. That's a wife. Shy said uh, arrested for public indecency. Um, that's a housewife. Look, she's got a little bit of lipstick on. Her little blush. Oh, she's so cute. Super cute. Thick as hell. You love to see it. I support her in all she does. Absolutely a housewife. I agree. And she wears a little apron. Yeah eating your tattoos as you are off the screen. Eating your tattoos as you are off the screen. Yummy, 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 yummy for me. Yummy, 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 yummy for me. <laughs> well, I wonder what he's doing over here. Are you doing blow? No. <laughs> she has a little pouch for carrying candy in. Oh. She's so cute. That's I literally really don't want cute. this list to run out. This is so fun. I know. Dreepy. That's a cool name. Dreepy. I gotta type it. Uh, go ahead. Excuse me. Shiloh eats Stevie's tattoos, not clickbait. <laughs> oh, he looks like a slimy little guy. I love him. Mm. Okay, he looks like he'd go, well, actually. Oh my god, he's a Joe Rogan listener. I could say anything and be like, well, actually. You're right. That is a sniveling little Joe Rogan listener. Like, you can just tell by his face he's, like, waiting for you to mess up so he can correct you. You're right. I would have called him gay. I think he's closeted and yeah. homophobic. Yeah. <laughs> I can also see the fanfic, though. I can see both. Those he's, are eyes that have seen everything. He's closeted until he writes the fanfic to yeah. be gay in the fanfics. Yeah. He writes insane fanfic. Yes, he does. It's in the eyes. I agree. It's definitely in the crazy eyes. He never sleeps. Oh, he's cute. He is cute, though. 
fanfic for sure. Okay, boys. Mr. Mime, we already did. Oh. Who is up next? Oh, this little motherfucker. A cutie. Bidoof. Bidoof. I think that's Bidoof. Let me see. Oh, wait, we did Droopy. That's why I got confused. Yeah. That reminds me of Bidoof's Law and Tumblr. Okay. That is too many O's, but I trust you. Um. Bidoof flavor. Okay. Okay. He's super cute. Um. I would skin and cook Bidoof over an open flame. Wow, that's my bestie. You can't I even like that. I hate this fucking bitch. Fanfic. What's wrong with Bidoof? What did Bidoof he do? He's playing the flute. What? He's playing the flute. You can't be mean to him. I love him. He looks like a little animal you would see on the side of the road, and then you adopt it. Bread loaf. Eat. Eat? No. Look at the two we have for kissing. They're so cute. He could win a small town election. I don't think he's smart enough. He has really <laughs> brainless eyes. He I think does. I could I think I could ethically eat him. No! There are no whites to his eyes. Don't eat him! Scroll up. Damn, I guess he doesn't fit anywhere else. Um He is a gay politician. I could see that politicians but politicians don't have to be smart, you know. I'd rather eat him. That's so terribly mean of you. Too bad. Delicious. I can't believe, I can't believe got this. got a four-course milk on up here. This is fucking delicious. How dare you? Know. First first my apple bestie and then Bidoof. Sorry. Next up is Conkledur. Conkledur. Conkledur, Conkledur, Conkledur. There you go. Whoa. Joe Rogan. I don't trust him. <laughs> he, fuck, he looks like Joe Rogan. Indecent exposure. Or indecent exposure. He looks like a ball sack. <laughs> Hold on. Oh, he I does. accidentally hit control. Oh, oh Hold on. okay. Oh my god, please. Death? What the fuck? He did not die. Okay. There, there he is, ladies and gents. Spot the difference. Oh my god. It is similar energy, you're right. He's got stubble. He would he would kill you instantly. He's got stubble. Um, Conquer would be a politician and fix the infrastructure. I don't believe you. I don't mm. believe you. I don't know if he's nice. I could see him having a background in construction, though. Whether yeah. that makes him good or bad, I think it makes him listen to the Joe Rogan podcast. So, fair. Where the fuck did he go? Right there. there. Yeah. God, all these pieces of shit up here. I hate them. <laughs> Um. Conkledur. All right, Shardy, who's next? Don't call me Shardy. Okay, Shardy, I won't. Oh my god. Next up is cast form. <laughs> wow, you could have left the seat for me. I'm gonna kill you on your own stream. Hey. What do you think of that? That's a joke, Twitch gods. I won't do anything. <gasps> Baby. He's got yiddies. He's got a balls. He's. He's got a balls. Um, I don't know what to think of him. Balls or Yiddies, one or the other. Why does he fucking look like that? I Why don't love it. Like I just don't love it. I could see this being a housewife or a male wife. Yeah. I guess he's a trophy wife. I could also eat that. It looks like whipped cream. Be nice to him. He'd be a good wife. He looks like a marshmallow. With titties? He looks like a marshmallow. With titties? Yes. <laughs> also, Streamlabs is frozen, so we have to wait for it to unfreeze. Oh, okay. Do we just sit? We do also have a chat over here. Yep, yep, okay. Um, Eat the tibby. Cash form rights fanfic. I can see that. Gay man. I can see him being a little fruity. I do too. Don't eat him. I kind of want to. Okay. He's just a little gay housewife. Or wait. I can see him being gay. I can also see him being a male wife. Absolutely twink behavior. Mhm. Mm I hate those balls. I think I think we should just put him in gay. I agree. I think we can safely do that. Ooh. Cash form would literally write fanfic about themselves. Oh, most, most probably. They have a high self-esteem. I love that for them. Me too. Quagsire. Oh, Quagsire. Okay. What a terrible little name. Okay, hit me with the Quagsire. I absolutely will. Aww, he's so cute. He could win an election. I love him. He would be trusted by everyone in town. But he has the stupid little eyes like you were talking about on the Bibloof or whatever. At the same time, we have had, like, like this one, uh, Lotad, 
I think that because he looks so simple and so trusting or trustworthy, fair. I think that people would would really go for that. I feel like he's secretly malicious, but he could win the election. Gay mayor, no thought, brain empty, secretly malicious. Yeah, but he he like could that. win the election. He could. Don't do him like that. Is this the only non PNG I have? I'm gonna shit myself. Looks like it. Damn. He's absolutely winning. He's winning. He wanted to stand out. Doug Trio, baby. We already know which one that one is. Doug Trio. Quagsire stands up right and makes him better than Badoof. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're just little poops. They're just little, they're just little poops. Well, the ones that I have are the ones with hair, and I think that makes them look like housewives. I see. Oh my god. They just, they just sit around all day and talk shit. Hmm? They just sit around all day and talk shit. Oh yeah, absolutely just gossiping all day long. They look very fun. Doug Trio is a polycule. You're right. Oh my god, you're right. You're right. Okay, well, wait, scroll down, scroll down. Bottom. Okay, sh you, they can't see where you're pointing. Hold on, okay, okay. Okay, bottom. bottom. Mm -hmm. One that they're both dating. Okay. Um, the old one. Femtop. Yeah. Um, <laughs> the old one. Don't be fucking rude. <laughs> um, I love them. Are these little mouths or little noses? Oh, I guess they're little they're noses. They're little noses. That's cute. Oh, he put his nose on me. They're really cute. Okay, boys. Absolutely marrying these motherfuckers. Yes, babe. Yes, babe. You tell me, babe. Yeah. Okay, it's caught up. Um, Galarian is next. Yeah. Can I spell Galarian? Had to stim on the screen a little bit. Yeah. Perfect. Oh, he's got a friend. I don't trust him very much. You can't tell because he's so blurry, though. <laughs> anyway, this is what he looks like. Um, is that really the one we have? Wait, 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 wait. huh? This doesn't look right. Wait, pull mm -hmm. him up again? Yeah, he doesn't seem he to be there. Oh. This is the motherfucker. I'm confused. Why are all these bitches popping Why up? Why are there so many different ones? Hey, do y'all know the difference? Oh, maybe it's like the evolutions of it that we're looking at? Because this is the one. Galar is re... Sorry, I literally just went based off of what Google image just popped up. We don't know shit about Pokemon. Galarian is a region. Shut up. What's his name? Galarian, the trio are gay drag queen triplets. You're right. <laughs> yeah, what's his name? Um, I don't care what his name, but that's what he looks like. Um, he looks kind of fun. He looks kind of fun. He's giving me gay bear. I can see. He's giving gay. me like elder gay bear that just like teaches you how to not be a baby yeah. anymore. The little, the little studs, little spikes. Yeah. Darmanitan? Darmanitan. Darmanitan. My bad, my bad. <laughs> yeah. Well, that is different a little That's bit. It's a different one, though. Y'all are really playing me. Guilt. Well, <laughs> old game. Guilt. Galarian Darman. Oh my god. Well, either way, I found him, and you know who I'm talking about. Shut up. Okay. Y'all are annoying me. <laughs> so what do you think? Uh, gay. Absolutely gay. I agree. Um, Galarian Darman. That's a stupid fucking name. You can tell him I said so. Per. Slay King. Oh my god. Literally called Slay King. Are you kidding? This one better be gay. I know. You're not gonna like it if it's the one I'm thinking of. Uh, I don't know which one you're thinking of, so let's see. Oh, him. Oh, my God. He reminds me of, uh, like, Grunkle Stan. He's seeping with gay energy. Don't do my husband like that, anyway. Don't talk shit about him. We're gonna have to fight. He has a lot of sexual energy that I really did not anticipate, and I don't like that. I don't yeah, like his pose. Yeah, I'm a wee bit uncomfortable. Why does he post stuff like that? Um, scroll up, scroll up, scroll up. That's me when you talk shit about Grunkle Stan. Anyway, moving on. Um... <laughs> Yeah, he's just gay. I could just, I could see him being, oh, but a decent exposure. Oh, you're right. Because I think you just assume that everyone wants him because he's, like, too confident. No, you're right. I could see that, too. Yeah, he's going to flash someone. He is giving that. Sud, sudu, wudu. Sudu, wudu. Sudu, wudu. Sudu, sudu, wudu. Sudu, wudu. Sudu, wudu. Cool. Sudu, wudu. I don't like that y'all keep choosing multiple categories. You know that saying podcast <laughs> positive gay is not going to be very good. Oh, he's just a little guy. Oh. However, those look like grapes. Someone said he has ball hands. Don't do him like that. I didn't say it. 
Came from Mouth of Babes. He's a tree man out of rock. He's a fucking rock type. That's, That's kind of cool. Me off. That is very misleading, but kind of cool. We're different. Ball hands, ball hands. He d ow, that Oops, hurt. I didn't mean to. I don't I don't mind it. That hurt. Sorry, Bessie. Thank you. Um <laughs> He does have the stance of a flasher. Oh, he looks like he just surprised someone. Yeah. <laughs> he does. <laughs> oh my the god. The angle and everything. He's like, hey, look, do you like it? Oh my god. I think that's how it goes. Yeah, no, I can see that. Yeah, he is giving that. L he's literally thrusting his pelvis forward. Terrible little man. Terrible little man. Treat us right, Sudowoodo. Treat us right, Sudowoodo. Any of them that are posed like that, I'm like, you are going to flash someone. Tim Pool. Tim Pool. All right, boys. Timothy for, for short. Tim Pool. Oh, pseudo fake. Pseudo means fake. He's a fake wood. Oh, that's fun. Very little. Gotta eat him, though. What? No. Shy side eat it. He looks so polite. He looks edible, though. No, you can't eat him. I don't care if you don't want to eat him. I would save him from the frying pan. Would he be tasty if you cooked him? No, he'd be my best friend for three days because he doesn't look like he has a long lifespan. Well, then I'm going to eat him before he can die. He'll die no. either way. He'll die either way. <laughs> Why are you treating him I just so get bad? To, I just get to eat him before he dies. I can't believe you. You're eating all my friends. Yeah. Don't eat the tail, though. Yeah, probably not. He looks like he has headphones. Yeah, he does. He does. I'll give you that. Oh, he's never divergent. You're going to eat him divergent. Is that what you're Anyway, next one. Terrible man. Hope that didn't get picked up. Fucker. Yeah. Um, Barb. <laughs> Barbara. Bar I can't say Barbara that. Barbara Cole. Barbara Cole. There you go. I could not pronounce Barbara that. Barbara Cole. Yeah, I'm gonna eat a frog tadpole. Shut up. Barbara Cole. Oh, I fucked it up. I keep hitting control instead, or like, or whatever it is. I've never had a computer that just does that when you hit control. Barbara Cole is racist? Okay. Bar. No. Whoops, okay, I didn't not, spell it, it right. It was not close enough, <laughs> as it turns out. Wow, he's a little scary. He looks awful. Now wait, why did they make him so fine in this picture? That's what I'm trying to figure out. I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> I hate that. Why'd they make him fine? Is it just me, or? Anyway, I don't like him. <laughs> I don't trust him. No, he's kind of... I'm gonna Why kill is you. he gonna? <laughs> I'm gonna kick you off the fucking stream. Um, I think he looks like he would flash someone. Yeah, he gonna do. Or listen to the podcast. He looks like an evil villain. He does look very evil. I don't trust him at all. He's got a head hand, and it scares me. I do wonder. What do you think? Do you think podcast or indecent, indecent, indecent exposure? He has extra hand. He has extra eyes on his hand. Everything is a hand with him. It's giving podcast. Yeah. Hi, non-binary squid. Hello, non-binary squid. We'll put him on. We'll put him on the. We'll put him on the Joe Rogan podcast. He lives ways to deal with the fact that no woman will talk to him. He really does. God. He really, really does. All right, lads. Oh my God, we've done it. We've done it. We've done it, boys. I helped. You did help. We only have a couple that were great kissers. Just just two. Just two. Just a couple. Listen, if I'd made one of these neurodivergent, holy shit, there would have been so many. <laughs> that actually is something to contend with. I feel like I probably should have done that with some of these bitches. Well, you know. Yeah. What a ride this was, indeed. This was incredible. I love that. I love that. Makes me feel very good. Thank you. Sorry, I'm easily distracted. If you don't want to kiss Pokemon, speak for yourself. Kiss. Kiss. Now, Lucario... Which one's Lucario? The sexy one. Uh, I think Mewtwo's sexy. The guy's hips. Oh, well, you're gonna judge me for what Pokemon I wanna- Okay. You have this too. I thought I did. What? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> he looks like a fucking Sonic character. No, he doesn't. Hold on, hold on, y'all. <laughs> no, he doesn't. I disagree with you. Really? Babe, this is embarrassing. <laughs> you want fucking Mewtwo? He's got little shorts on. Mewtwo looks like he came from Chernobyl. Yeah, this looks like he came from the fucking Sega universe. Is this what you want? 
My cardio's fine. I don't care. I don't care. That is all friends, Sonic. Fuck you guys. Yeah. Yeah. Oh wait, I was thinking of the wrong one when you said Mewtwo. Were you thinking Meowth? Yes. No, he's a very little guy. I got the confused earlier. Yeah, that's why I was like, Meowth. Come on. You know? Yeah. That tail, those hands were for your pleasure. I yeah. guess you're right. I guess you're right. 100% yes. I see what you mean. I love Thank it. Thank you, Aries. Someone's in my corner. Someone. Okay. Look at this shit. Ludicolo. Would make the perfect politician. I would vote for him. Yeah. Yeah. Can't decide if I should play another game or just sign off and go on for a little bit. Which was a he him lesbian and me was a she they lesbian. I cuddle and watch the food, but I will not touch you. Oh, that's a good idea. Oh, I'm leaving y'all. If you're if you're somewhere it's the morning, I hope you have a great day. If you're somewhere it's the evening, I hope you have a are you are you stimming on my arm? No. Are you <laughs> sorry. I do blah 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 have a great day. If you're somewhere it's the evening, I hope you have a great night. Please drink some water, have a meal, have a snack, take care of your body. I love you very much. Uh, I guess that's about it. Don't forget our sub goal. We are going to be, hopefully, hopefully not. I don't know how to feel about it. Meeting our sub goal of 50 subs by the end of the month. And the end of the month is this Thursday. So Thursday stream is our last stream to make me play Fnat with Shiloh. And it will be very spooky and very bad. Um, so I trust your judgment on whether or not I should play it. We're going to find someone to raid. And I will see you in the next one. Wait, can I say something before you go? Uh, yeah, go ahead. Okay, bye.